Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this is going to be a little short video about tracing. I was watching uh, one of my mentors, Roger Wombolt, with Corel Corporation doing a video about 2020, uh, uh, Corel 2020, which I just got today, uh, but I'm not using that because it'll do this pretty much any version. And he he just took a bitmap. And it's 72 dots per inch, and he didn't do anything to it. He just went and traced it, and it traced pretty good. And one of the things that's coming out in 2020 is a new tab here, but you can see the colors, and we've got five colors. But when you go to settings, you can have it group by colors, and then hit OK. So now we're going to move our... Uh, trace version, which it surprisingly traced really good without any converting or sharpening or upscaling or upsizing or anything. But what is, I never have done this before with group by color. So we're going to make a yellow box and go to object in order and back of the page. And you can see the white colors. And there's uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten white things. Well, grab our new image and go up to object and group and ungroup and then click on your white and just hit the delete key. So now those are transparent because you can see through them. It kind of looks funny because the, the guy's bib is is uh, uh, yellow too, but it got rid of all the white. And what's so cool about this, if you're you know possibly a laser engraver and you want to make all the orange black, and you want to make the, all the yellows gray, and you want to make the feet, you know, a different color of black, a different shade of gray, they're grouped together so you can play around with them. And now we'll look at it with the background, and you can see that you can see through the holes and through his eyes. So give that a try, kind of play around with that. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.